one for 20k. Won't let me. Bring it on. 20 grand. Yeah, come on. <laughs> All right, Sandy, put it there, mate. Yeah, brilliant stuff. 20k. Ready, boy? Of course I'm ready. Oh. Two Chelsea fans. Hang on, hang on. Right, come on then. Right, Sandy, for 20 grand, the chase is on. There you go, mate. He's getting all limbered up. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Good luck, Sandy. Here comes your first question. Bill Clinton and Donald Trump were both born in what year? A, 1936, B, 1946, C, 1956. You've put 46. I think he's the same age as my mum, who's 72, so I'm Cr pretty, pretty wow. confident. Unless I've got my maths wrong. Correct answer is... Step close to home, well played, Chase has put. Goes right, 46. Here's the next question. Great start. The Anzio landings of World War II were planned to outflank the Germans and allow an attack on which city? A, Alexandria, B, Rome, C, Athens. You've put Athens. I wasn't expecting any of them to come up, to be honest. Uh, when it first came Anzio, I was assuming it might be something to do with um, help from the New Zealanders or something like sure. that. Sure. So really... Oh, like, you mean like the Anzacs? Yeah. Correct answer is... Yeah, Rome it is. Italian, Anzio. Staying where you are. Okay. Chasers put. Yeah, it goes with yeah, Rome. 1944. Yeah. yeah. Here we go. Here's the next question. Chasers one behind. We're doing all right, though. Which football club derived its nickname the Honest Men from a poem by Robert Burns. A, Celtic. B, Heart of Midlothian. C, Air United. You've put Air United. Well, living in Scotland, I think if it had been one of the other two, I would have heard of it. Correct answer is... Well played. Step close to home, Chase has put... Goes also A hey, United. Here's the next question. We're four from home now. Which of these artists had a muse called Candy Darling? Oh, gosh, a Paul Cezanne. B Andy Warhol. C Joshua Reynolds. Oh, uh, got it. You've put Warhol. I did that because back in the sixties. Everyone I can imagine that was something exactly like that. Exactly. Mate. I can't imagine Paul Suzanne, but. Um, they had names like that back yeah, in. Yeah, I reckon. Correct answer is. I reckon it's Warhol. Yeah, well played. Step close home. Chase has put. Goes also with Warhol. Yeah, his studio is called Factory. And uh, right. Valerie Solanis, I believe, tried to murder him sometime in the 60s, but he eventually died in 1987. Thank you. Here's your next question. In Toy Story 3, Buzz Lightyear is accidentally reset and starts speaking what language? A, French. B, Italian. C, Spanish. Glad that came up. Yeah. You've put... Spanish. I've seen it. I'm sure it's Spanish, but, you know, you doubt yourself, don't you? Yeah, correct answer is... It is absolute Spanish. Step close home, well done. Chase has put... Yeah. Here's the next question. Who is the custodian of the Great Seal of the Realm? A, Lord Chancellor. B, the Attorney General. C, the Prime Minister. Here we go, you've put Lord Chancellor. Yeah, it's a 50-50 between that and the Prime Minister, but to be honest... Custodian, like the Lord Chancellor. He looks after the money, he looks after the... Yeah. Correct answer is... Woo! Step close to home. Chase has put... This is a great head-to-head -head opening. Now it's a chance of the Exchequer. So you're going to give me a break? Oh, yeah, chance yeah. Exchequer. Thank you. Here we go, one more home So drive. one question shoot out, mate. Can't believe I've managed to get a one question shoot against, against Sean Wallace. Yeah. That's tops, isn't it? Is it? <laughs> you're a tops contestant, mate, honestly. He is a good contestant. Oh, Actually, brilliant. Here's your question. Which Australian cricket captain was nicknamed Tugger? A, Alan Border. B, Greg Chappell. C, Steve War. <laughs> Need an answer. Go. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have put Steve War. 
What made you put that? Do you know what? I think I can't stand the game of cricket. Um, but Alan Border seems to ring a bell as a different Era. nickname. I don't know. Yeah. I, I was torn between Greg Chappell and, you know, 50-50, mate. To go through with 20 grand, the correct answer is... Do you... They are. Tug of war. I never even thought about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Never even... Uh, Tug of war. Got lucky, then. No, you didn't get lucky. You played well, mate. Thank you, boss.